Hey everyone, welcome back. I am the Electrical Code Coach, and this is the electrical question of the day. In the 2017 NEC and previous editions, equipment grounds count as blank total based off the largest conductors in the box when considering box fill. So we're talking about a box fill calculation, and we're talking about how we deal with the equipment grounds. So these are the bare, solid, stranded, or covered conductors that we use for normally non-current carrying parts. They're your ground wires in the box. And for this, we're going to head over to 314.16b5. And one through, let's see, one through five is are going to give us our prescription for how to deal with clamps inside a box fill and how to deal with these other things. And number five is how to deal with equipment grounds. Well, in the 2017 and previous, it's really easy. They only count as one total based off the largest conductor in the box. So if you have 10s and 12s inside of a box and you had 10 equipment grounds, it would only count as one for your count for your box fill. It would only count as one based off the larger conductor, which in this case is the 10 gauge. Now, when you get into the 2020 and later, they've changed it. In the 2020, it reads like this. When up to four equipment grounding conductors or equipment bonding jumpers are in a single box, a single volume allowance shall be in accordance with this table. So it's one, but here's the new part of the code. After four, a quarter of inch volume allowance shall be made for each additional equipment ground past four. So up to four, it counts as one. Then when you get past that, it counts as a quarter of a volume which is to me kind of a convoluted way to calculate it, but I'm not here to talk about some of the convoluted things that are in the code book. But with that being said, 2017 and previous, you would just count it as one based off the largest conductor in the box. So it would count as one number 10. And when you get to the 2020 and later, you count up to four of them as one. And then after that, you will increase that by one quarter inch volume for each one past four. I am the Electrical Code Coach, and my bargain is that these videos will add value to you, and you will in turn add value to others. If you click right there on the screen, you can sign up for a lifetime membership to the Electrical Exam Coach program at electricalexamcoach.com. You'll click on that link. It'll take you over to my Electrical Code Coach website. You can get it on sale right now for $49.99. You click on it, and then you'll have lifetime access to the Electrical Exam Coach website and everything that we build on that platform. Let's get to it.